Welcome to Why Can't You? And today I want to talk about uh, now soon to be ex Louisville basketball coach Rick Patino and transparency. I think in this day and age, with so much information being available, transparency is just it's a huge part of our of our economy. It's a huge part of our currency. We all expect that of people now because information is traveling around at such a fast pace. So what made me do this vlog was I think it was on September 26 when. Uh, Rick Patino, when Louisville was charged with allegations of, you know, funneling money from a shoe company to a recruit, and Rick Patino came out of the newspaper and said that he was absolutely shocked by these allegations, and I, I think I literally fell out of my chair laughing because I followed the career of Rick Patino for a long time. I read his book that he put out years ago called Success is a Choice, and I really loved what he said about how he inspired guys, how he got them to visualize beyond where they were today as players, as, as individuals, and as teammates to succeed more than they could on their own. And Rick has had great success over the years taking underdog teams to Final Fours and National Championships. And so just to hear him say that he was shocked by these allegations, as I said, it, it made me chuckle because Rick was known for being so intensely involved in the recruiting of, of players that he liked that he would even find out what kind of chewing gum they preferred. So for him, and no one's you know guilty until proven so, but for him not to know that somebody was funding $100,000 to one of his recruits to have him go to Louisville University, it just came as a shock to me and it just sort of puts a, a damper on his career and his life just by him not being transparent. And he was being investigated by the FBI at this point. This wasn't the NCAA. I think you just want to be a, a, little, a little more forthcoming when the FBI is knocking on your door. And so this Why Can't You is just uh, devoted to all leaders and all coaches just to be transparent with who you are because that's what people respect. That's what I respect. I, I don't respect people who you know, shun away from things when they come their way. I admire people who, when they're accused of wrongdoing, admit it and say, hey, that was me. I'm like, wow, I totally respect and I admire that person and I'll stand behind them as they fight to overcome whatever, whatever accusations are levied against them. But when you sort of just play dumb, it, it's not attractive. And I don't think other people find it that way either. So why can't you, Rick, be transparent? My challenge to all coaches and leaders give some transparency. I'm David Bryson. This is Why Can't You? Please subscribe to my vlogs and there's more to come soon.